reactions are on Patreon, or if you want, you can pull up your copy of Lego Ninjago Masters of Spinjitzu, Episode 4 of Season 7, Scavengers. And press planet when I press play when the timer reaches zero. Is this perhaps going to be them scrounging up the necessary parts to bring Zane back to full functioning capacity? Oh. Yeah, the first episode so far is easily the best episode. Just because the fight with Wu was legitimately rather good. The rest of this has... I want to be positive, but I've, I've not got much to work with. Hey, at least you're walking around. <laughs> well, come on. Well, how did you make it darker outside? Neat trick there, bro. Okay, okay. So, you, yeah. Yeah. You got time blasted. Oh, that would be bad. You pushed the wrong button? No way. Okay, okay. Man. As much as I love Zane, I'm always sad to see him kind of take a back seat. Almost like you could have said this from the TV! <laughs> I like her being pretty fed up with it just being stuck there. It's it it's got potential. One more time. Three twelve. In three two one go. Yep. Okay. You and Garmadon always trying to be sacrificing yourselves. <laughs> Not your fault. Not your fault. Yeah, it, would, it probably wouldn't do you much good. Yeah. 
<laughs> Which is pretty low tier in terms of armies that Ninjago have had to deal with. I'd still say the army of robots was the worst one for the average Ninjago citizen. Cause he had a bad day. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> but we can do that. You've got one leader. This has already been proven several times. Acceptable enough! Alright, I'll take it. They're not shooting him down. They're being a little... They're being a little... Ah... Uh, Reductive, but hey. Eh. I have a plan. Attack. One of the greatest lines in the MCU. Yes! Parking meters destroyed! I'm on their side already! <laughs> okay, they work fast. Alright. We went from Ninjago being floated away to being sunken down. One... Parking meter at the dead of time, okay. Ah! <laughs> Oh, is that the goal? You're the Kung Fu Panda 2 all over again? So is this the goal of every season is to have two minions who are just kind of lovable dopes? Because I honestly kind of wish it had been the same lovable dopes that we got in tournaments. He just kept the screaming up all the way. <laughs> 809. 809. In 3, 2, 1, go. That's perfect. I love that. <laughs> wow. Only I get to do it. <laughs> I love he just ran straight to somebody he knew to replace them, apparently multiple times at this point. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Jeez, she just got here, dude. <laughs> Come on, guys. Yeah, <laughs> they're like, we're not really up on the plot of this season. So leave one person behind. Have, yeah, make a phone call if something happens. <laughs> She's not even home. Oh, okay, okay. Not what I expected. I guess you are made of metal. What? He said my body, but it sounded like Rita Repulsa. <laughs> I mean, I probably that wasn't even an in intentional. Go back to Power Rangers. I I don't blame them for this one. It just sounded like her saying my putties. Why didn't that hurt Nia? Well, I mean, actually, somebody else is. <laughs> Why did they need to specify that? Okay. Hello? I love how quickly he adapted. Is there no signal down here? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I kind of wish it was still the same two dopes from Tournament of Power, because Tournament of Elements, whatever it was, <laughs> because, gosh, I'd love if every time there was just an evil army, they showed up, they put on the right clothes, and they're like, we're here! That'd be such a great running gag. Them getting slightly more dangerous with each passing season as they gain new skills. I did not know that. To be fair, I'd never really questioned what an avocado was. Goddamn, these are the most hard-working minions. Because that's a lot of work for one snake to pull each of those pieces of metal. Ooh. Alright, points, that's pretty creepy. <laughs> oh, come on. Now? Come on. Maybe you really did deserve a trophy.
Ninjago. Uh, thanks for the running commentary, guys. All right. Operation Blackout being... What? We're gonna steal Mr. Burns' plan and block out the sun? No kidding. Well, that too, but... I'm glad that you acknowledge that. Then nothing. I mean, that's a pretty easy answer, but all right. <laughs> ha. Nice. Average amount! Average amount! Cool. Provisionally. <laughs> Why do they always have to do you like this, Zane? I wish... I, 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 ooh, yeah, here, perfect. I wish... Even more, we'd get moments of pixels just inside going, No, you fools! Over there! I want Pixel to be the new narrator, just fed up with every decision the ninja make. That was pretty pathetic, guys. That was also pretty pathetic, guys. What the heck? That could be a standing desk. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Ooh. And without the armor, they, they can't hold themselves together.
I mean, does it have to be Zane's power here? Nice. <laughs> the snakes are like, so, let's just talk about this. What a unique skill set to have. Like, it's one thing to have all the electrical knowledge she already has, but enough knowledge to, turn, to bring an entire power plant back online single-handedly without having to check a manual or nothing. Game over, man! Game over! Yeah, so there's some some bad news. Hey, hey. Oh, no. Is she still back at the Samurai X? Is she going to be Samurai X? Hell yeah. I mean, call them. Say something. Like, hey, back me up. This was a better episode than the last couple. Not amazing. I'm still not... I'm not... I'm not grabbed by this season. Okay, though. Next time.